An endless labyrinth of mind-boggling turns and deadly enemies. This final journey was more dangerous and trying than our heroes had ever seen before. Once again, don't know if the game knows this, but we did go through 300 trials. I have my doubts seriously about this being the hardest and most trying we've ever seen before. Seriously, it was pretty hard before, but... Mario and his friends kept on without Bowser, who was lost in a duel. No, he wasn't lost in a duel, he got crushed by a ceiling. That's not lost. Getting lost is like, hey, I don't know where I am, I need a GPS, I need some help. Getting crushed by a ceiling, that's like death, that's not getting lost. There was no time to stop and search for Bowser or even grieve. Wait, why are we grieving? He lost, he got lost in the duel. That's no reason to grieve, according to the game. The only reason we should grieve is he got crushed by a ceiling, which ironically he did, so maybe we should stop and grieve a little bit. Just a little maybe, I don't know. Oh well, our heroes knew they had to rush toward the final encounter with Count Black. I guess so, we got no time to stop and worry about Bowser whatsoever. And we're now into chapter 8-2, the crash. The boom, the thunder, and the crash, all right. <clears throat> Looks like the void's getting a little bit bigger in the background. Another tremor, I've lost count of them all. It is strange, I mean, this is Count Black's private castle, right? So why would he let the destruction ravage his own home? Because he doesn't care. What sort of evil plan is it if he destroys himself in the process? The very best evil kind of plan. Look at that. Hmm. Just maniacal. Bloomy air, so it really is you. Yeah, it is. Ahem, um, let's let's just keep moving. We need to find Count Black soon. Yeah, let's do that, Tippy. Let's do that before you go any crazier on me. Oh no! Hamburgers! Don't do it, hamburgers. Oh, come on, man. Come on, hamburger. Don't be like that. We ignore you, because you're just asking to kill me. You are killing me. I'm just going to... Yeah. Not worry about that. Oh! More of these eyeballs. More of these things. Gotta run. I could stop and defeat them all, but what's the point? You know, what's the point? Why, why make this episode much longer than it needs to be? We've already seen all these enemies before. We've already beat all the crap of them. Oh my gosh, it's Merlin. What the hell is he doing here? Why is Merlin here? How did he get here? Oh ho ho, you finally arrived! Hey Merlin, what's up? Merlin, what are you doing here? I found a fascinating passion in light prognostica, so I rushed here to tell you. Wait! That can't be Merlin! Merlin doesn't read! That can't be Merlin! Merlin never reads the light prognosticus! That's gotta be Mimi, right? Right, that's gotta be Mimi. And the the only reason I know is because Mimi can transform and Merlin doesn't read. So if Merlin doesn't read, there's no possible way he read a passage in the Light Prognosticus. No way. To get to Count Black, it seems you must hit this totally unsuspicious block. Okay, well that, that confirms my, my suspicions, but um, yeah. Wow, can't believe it was that obvious. As soon as Mimi said, I read this passage, I automatically knew it wasn't Merlin because Merlin doesn't read or do anything useful or convenient to the game. So why don't you give it a jolly old whack? Why don't I give you a jolly old whack right across the skull, you jerk? I don't want to hit it. What are my options? Do I have to hit that? Seems like I am stuck. Oh, there's something in the ceiling. I want to go that way. I don't know if I can make that's kind of high. Yeah, oh well. I could try Luigi, but the thing is, the hole's only in 3D, and Luigi in 2D won't make it up there. I guess I have to hit this stupid block, all right. Tee hee! What a bunch of... What a bunch of what, Merlins? What a bunch of what? You're not Merlin. Mimi suckers! There are a bunch of suckers! Well, Mimi, you're the sucker because you kind of told us that, you know, you read, and automatically that gave it away. All right, so let's sneak through the bars here. Mm, just can't go through that way. And, oh, just can't go through the bars like this. Well, there's clearly spaces. Oh, well, there's a crack right there. That's even more obvious. Let's just go ahead and use Boomer. All right, wherever Boomer is, wherever I keep missing him. Yeah, I was on Slim and missed Boomer. Wow, guy right above it. Didn't place the bomb anywhere close, but still got through there. Okay, that works for us. All right. Whoa, weird, weird flip thing. Okay, there's a door right here. 
Um, guess, yeah, let's just go in this door. The, this room went a lot longer, though. Oh, okay, this looks fun. Not, not fun. Uh, that wasn't too bad, actually. Yeah, just walk straight. What did that do? What did this do? Does this do something? I don't know. Something moved. Uh, I don't know. Okay, this will be hard to go this way. Oh, no, it won't. This will be really easy to go this way. Wow, 3D Mario makes this a lot easier than 2D Mario. All these things are trying to kill me in 3D. I don't really appreciate that when they try and kill me like that. Oh, hey, why is the pipe here? Why is the pipe there? Oh, does that thing move it? Well, what's with all those? Th oh, so the, oh, well, I have to like get it right? Well, let's find out this door first. Maybe it'll give me a hint to which passageway to go into. Can't use Boomer, gotta use Carry. Wow, I gotta use Carry for actual purpose, which is to ride on top of these things. And I can attack spiky enemies. I use Carry for, every oh, didn't mean to do that. Wow, did not mean to get off that. Wow, it's gonna put me right there and just get injured, aren't, aren't I? Move on forward. Okay, not cool. No, okay, not cool again. Stop that. Oh, that just, oh, okay, I bet you that moves it right and the other one moves it left. I don't know which way we want to move it, though. Let's just leave it wherever it's at for now. Let's go try it. Let's go try and see where we're at. So one, two, three, yeah, four, five. Okay, there's five possible spots. I guess I should have just tried one, but let's just go ahead and try two. Whatever. Two works. Two probably is better than one anyways, right? I mean, one's, one's not good. Where am I? Two. Wait, do these all lead to the same spot? Five, four, three, two. Oh, so one was the correct pathway, if this is to be believed. Oh, but there's a little lightning bolt thing. Strikes enemies with lightning. That sounds pretty good. Better than Sleepy Sheep. Bye, Sleepy Sheep. Yeah, okay. Looks like this isn't the correct way. All right, so can I just go back down these pipes? Does that work? Will the game let... Oh, the game was going to try me on the side. Okay. Will the game let me go back down to these pipes? That's the question. Okay, yeah. It, it is exactly that. All right, so... Okay, ironically, the first one I had picked, pipe number one, was the correct one, so... Yeah, and way to go, Coops. Way to get it right, luckily, and then to totally mess it up anyways. So, uncool, man. Uncool. I'm just gonna ignore all of these burning fire things of doom. Move it over and head on back. No problems whatsoever. We got this. All these guys trying to kill me, they're not doing too well about that, so... This unlimited 3D is so nice. I I am glad we went ahead and got Flopside done and out of the way and earned that earned that unlimited 3D. That's making that nice. Ooh, treasure chest. Cool. What do we got? We got a courage shell. Briefly just damage take by half. Don't need. Don't even care. What we got here? A castle key. Always, always appreciated. And a mushroom, or health, or a life shroom. Well, life shrooms are good. I already I lost mine, so let's go ahead and throw out, uh, actually, these are all good things. Let me throw out the Thunder Rage for a second, eat some health. <clears throat> Sorry about that. Eat some health, and, uh, yeah, we don't really need that health, though. Um, eh, whatever. Let's just go ahead and eat the whack -a bump Doesn't really matter. We're getting close to the end of the game. We have a ton of health still left, so. I guess the whack a was better than the Thunder Rage, though. Well, anyways. Where am I go from here? Oh, well, okay. Guess I go down that hole right there that I was about to fall into. All right, so down this hole we go. Oh, and we're back over here. I see how that all works. Well, we, we don't wanna, we wanna go this way. We have the key now. Why would they hide the key for that door in the room above it? You just fall through a hole to get there, whatever. Hello, Goombas. Oh, not going so well for you. That Hammer Brother's being really annoying, so we're not gonna, oh man, you can flip into 3D too, but we're just gonna ignore them. I am not dealing with that. Let's go through this door. I wonder if this door's useful. The last door, it had some items, I guess, but it wasn't like useful, useful. This, this, wait, do we not have Bowser? Oh yeah, we did lose Bowser. I mean, I, I, I knew that, but I, I thought like we, um, oh, there's something over here. 
Like, I thought we maybe got him back after the end of the chapter, but no, he's gone. Oh, guess he died for real. Wow, that stinks for him. Yeah. Stinks for our whole team, I guess, doesn't it? But what do we got over here? An Ultra Shroom Shake. They really want me to have health, don't they? Got two Shroom Shakes and two Ultra Shroom Shakes. Uh, I guess it's time for the Fire or Ice to go. Because Thunder Rage is decently good. Fire or Ice, which one's better? I don't really know. We just saw the Ice Storm, so let's get rid of that. We already saw that being used. And so we'll use the Firestorm next time. We got a lot of health items. I don't think I'm going to need that much health, but just in case. Nothing on that. Oh, that was close. Oh, no! Oh, that's good. All my controls are flipped. That makes everything so much easier. Well, while they're flipped, let's just go ahead and uh, grab Piccolo and use him for his intended purpose, which is, I guess, to take off curses. Sweet, thank you, Piccolo, for that like one one use you have. I mean, I guess it's a good use. Can't can't blame the guy, but all right. So that door held health, and that's about it. Can't, I, you know, that's, that's good, I guess. But okay, you gotta dodge that and the fire and flip into the 3D and dodged everything. All right, these guys are gonna flip two in 3D, but that's not gonna matter. Kick him to be a jerk. Oh, I still. Have, wow, do I still have this power? I got it for the second time I went through Flopside. That was a long time ago. Oh, whatever. And a POW blocked. What can I do with this? Rouse enemies on the ground and ceiling. I don't know if that's better than Fire Burst or not. Uh, I don't. I think I haven't seen POW, so let's get rid of the Fire Burst. Doesn't really matter to me. I, I need to use these items, but I don't, so. <laughs> What's going on? Ooh. Oh no, it's like, oh, it's like the castle from before. I really want that elf. But if I, but if I get it, I'm gonna die. Do I even need it? Uh, let's get a running jump. We can make a running jump and get it. No, what, why do I stop? Why do I stop moving? Oh, you can walk over it, but if you get health, you, you, oh, what is it? Oh no, do I have to fight you guys? Oh, crap. Wow, that was not worth it. Not worth it in the slightest. Guess they're trying to get good use out of all the pixels we got throughout the whole story. Eat the bombs. Eat the bombs. Bombs are good for you. All right, do I have to defeat all three of you? Oh, whatever. Have another one. Good for you. Good calcium. Full of nutrients. Just kidding. They're explosive. They're going to kill you. From the inside out, though, I'm surprised one bomb doesn't kill him. You feel like eating one bomb in your stomach, having that blow up, would be just kind of enough to finish you off. All right, that is our return pipe out of there. Did we get anything for that, or just have to suffer? All right, we just had to suffer. Okay, so getting these hells was not... Mario, you want to go through that pipe? All right, thanks, dude. So getting the health is not worth it. So I guess we should have skipped the health. You might want to jump and get it, but let's ignore it. Do our best to ignore the health hanging right above me. I want that health so badly. Oh no, but it's a locked door! Where's the key? Oh crap, you know what? I bet you the key's in one of these things down here at the health. Oh. Let's let's go look. It's nowhere I can't see it anywhere else. You probably one of these things you probably defeat and actually get the key. Hell's in here. Oh no, enemies! Oh. Oh, and they left a key. Wow. I was worried that was gonna be hard. That was not hard in the slightest. I just I just jumped to the first guy, killed them both, got a key. I don't know what was in the second one. In the second thing. And maybe it was an item. Doesn't matter, I'm full health. I'm full I'm full on items. I don't need anything. There's nothing down there that could be useful for me. So let's just move on, move on forward. You know, not a big deal. Oh, hello. How magnificent I you have arrived. I saw in the stars you would survive. Heroes, do not flee, for I am the lovely, mysterious Merly. I kind of have my doubts. Maybe it's Merly, but it's probably Mimi once again. Didn't she dress up as Merly before? Didn't we like find out it wasn't Merly because she didn't have flies around her? So she doesn't have flies again, so it's probably Mimi. 
My beauty and the stars led you here. Rest now, for you have nothing to fear. Do we? Um, are you really Merly? Humph! <laughs> Whatever is that you imply, how could anyone wonder if it is I? Look at this lovely aura glow! Does it not tell you all that you need to know? Ah... I will now ask you questions three. The answers you hold... will, will hold your future's key. And you must answer each and every query honestly and fairly. Here we go, time to start the show. Which one of these beasts is the hardest for you to make deceased? Which one's the hardest to kill? Goombas, Clubbas, or Ultra Shrooms? Clubbas are those little, like, rock guys. Goombas are Goombas. Ultra Shrooms are Mushrooms. Which one's the hardest for me to kill? Uh... Probably Clubbas. But what happens if I answer Ultra Shrooms? I don't know. Ultra, sh Ultra Shrooms are hard to defeat. Hee <laughs> hee! So that one that gives you the biggest scare? Ultra Shrooms? Next! Which one of these fearsome three most riles your knees? Fuzzies, Hammer Brothers, or Thunder Rage? Which one scares me the most? Thunder Rage. Thunder Rage scares me the most! Yeah! You're most scared of those? Hee <laughs> hee! That's very good to know. Now, which of these do you despise like fleas? Amazing Daisy, Cookie Mistake, or Francis? Oh man, Francis, I despise Francis. That is what makes you so very furious indeed, how curious. Well, it's been marvelous fun, but I'm afraid our time together is quite done. But do not fear or fret. No, we shall meet again yet. Hee 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 hee. I have a feeling that that wasn't Merly. And then I'll probably be running into maybe those those things I fear in the near f Oh, look at that. Look at that. Guys, don't look at it! It's so fearsome, that Ultra Shroom laying there wanting me. That is some scary stuff right there. Oh, please don't be... Oh, I guess there was no Thunder Rage. I thought there maybe would be a Thunder Rage. Man, I thought I, I thought we got it all figured out here. Oh, just kidding. Oh, don't look, guys. It's so scary. So scary. An evil Thunder Rage. Oh, so intimidating. So intimidating. I can't even hold on to it. It's so scary. Oh, wait. Does that mean this is going to be Francis? Are we fighting Francis? Is that... Oh, where's... What's going on? Oh, it's my sweet, sweet Francine. Yes, we're fighting Francis again. Oh, how scary. It's you. What are you doing here? I thought I'd gotten rid of those horrible images from my mind. Uh, uh, those are still on the internet, aren't they? Yeah, I don't know. I was in my comfy chair watching Starship x Not when I warped here. Maybe my re look in the Tron 4500 exploited my dreams and couch warped me to you. <laughs> Nothing is going to take you away from me this time, Francine. Yeah, 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 yeah. Oh, do we have to fight him again? Well, that's kind of lame. Can we just walk through the door? Oh, we could. Well, let's, let's, let's humor him a little bit and fight him. Oh, there he is. Oh, I can't see. Oh, well, that didn't do much. She just took a really obnoxious flash. Put Boomer there for no apparent reason. No, little cat's coming from the... Oh, he's got... There's... How do you get the Yon Cats in here? It seems kind of weird. Whoa, that was close. And it did one damage to... Probably should just jump on him. It's not really working putting a planting a bomb. So, let's go ahead and get a... grab out... Dasho. So I can get around speedily. Where are you, Francis? Come out. No. Got him. Did I? Did I get him? I don't know. I got flashed instead. Exactly what I didn't want to happen. Do not want giant frog thing, toad thing flashing me. Oh, I did get him there. That's good. Now I gotta fight these enemies that blow up. Neon cats that blow up. They kill each other too, which is really funny to me. Oh no! Get out! Get out! Get out! Get out! Oh, gross! Been swallowed. Escape. Yeah, escape. I don't want that. Ew. I don't like when he licks me. Wait, what happens if I switch to Peach? Does he get a, like, hearty? I don't know. Come on, Peach. Jump, jump. Jump, jump. Jump like your life depends on it. Man, I'm not doing so well in this fight so far. There we go. Oh, now he's gone. Okay, I'm doing all right, aren't I? Yeah, get off me, big oaf. Yeah, that's impossible. My, my high check dickle battle moose failed me. <laughs> That's it! I'm going to run a simulation on my computer to figure out what went wrong! 
Instaboner gone! Instaboner gone! No. That was odd. What is he doing here? Anyways, yeah, that's what I thought. Our worst fears came true. And we fought Francis again. Eek! What are you trying to pull, impossible? It is Mimi, and she looks kind of like she's got no arms and no legs. Maybe she... Someone chopped them off. I'm guessing they're black and they're right there, but you really can't see them in the black background, so... Oh well. I put everything you hate in there! How'd you get through all that icky stuff? Unless you bad people were lying! We were lying, weren't we? I wasn't really afraid of Ultra Shrooms that much. How dare you lecture us! You were just pretending to be Merlin and Merly, and the Merlin disguise was really obvious. Reading books, he doesn't do that. Talk about a dirty trick, you should be ashamed of yourself. Ashamed of myself? I like getting what I want, so I do whatever I need to do to get it. You're the one that's always having to get rescued by boys. That's embarrassing. Ooh, tell it like it is. Snapping it down, bringing it down hardcore on the Princess Peach. Yeah, Princess Peach, you always have to get rescued by boys. Have a little bit of feminine equality here. You can rescue boys. How about that, Princess Peach? Golly, you sure are a lot of talk when you have your little boyfriends to protect you. Oh! Oh! Man, Mimi sees it as it is. That's exactly how it is. That's exactly true. Humph! You. You son of a... Very well. If you insist, I'll give you what you so richly deserve. Um, Princess Peach, you're, you're not really going to... Stay out of this! I am a princess, and she has thrown mud at my dignity. You two, leave me be. You know why she's thrown mud? It's actually not mud. She's actually speaking the truth, and it hurts. It hurts because it's true. Understood? Yeah, this is when we get out. Cat fight coming up. Cat fight. <laughs> they, they walk out backwards. That's hilarious. Cat fight. Aw, the widow pretty princess wants to face me all alone. Boy, it sure would be sad if your boyfriend's had a cry over spilled peaches. Oh, man, Mimi's on top of this. Me, 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 me. Oh, not the creepy neck breaking thing. Oh, I didn't want to see that. That's never good. Uh, why should you have to do that, man? Oh, oh, those are legs? Oh, you can barely see those. That's not good for me. Me, me. Try not to cry, or all your pretty makeup will run. Time to go bye bye, princess. Oh, no. How do I. Oh, we don't want Dashel for this. We want. Uh, we want throw, actually, don't we? Because she spits out diamonds normally. That's what she did in the last fight, at least. Yeah, there we go. Coming up. Nope, we gotta throw them at her, not just, like, annoying them. Alright, there we go. And, oh, no, we got injured. Okay, I think we can also jump on her if we want. Good. Oh, and gotta dodge those a little bit better than that. No, I'm not doing a very good job here. I am not playing very well today. Look at this, totally missing. Where did that one come from anyways? Right, grab this. No, no. How do we defeat this? Defend that? Wow, that just totally missed me or did I defend that? I don't know. Okay, gotta get out of that. Nope, she's still got her. Oh, careful, careful, Princess Peach. No, I didn't get it, darn it. I'm not doing a lot of damage to her. Yeah, there we go, there we go. Yeah, there we go, that's what I wanna see. Oh, no, got dodge. How did that miss? How did that miss? Oh, how did that miss too? What am I stuck on? Oh, I'm stuck on a red thing on the ground. Oh, no, I lost all my items too. Oh, wow, I'm not fighting this well. Come back here, stop spinning around. You're just wasting time. You know you're gonna lose soon, Mimi. Creepy neck-breaking spider abilities. Oh, so weird. All right, grab that and do something like that. No, not like that. Do this. No, oh, come on, Princess Peach. Don't be lame. No, no, that was lame. All right, let's try jumping and let's try throwing it at the enemy we're facing. Cool, dog. Works like that. No, no. Yeah, more damage. Doing a lot of damage to her, but I don't think it does it by damage. I think it does it by her legs. All right, there goes another one. Oh yeah, yeah. Okay, you gotta hit her and then knock off her legs. So I'm not really doing anything right now, am I, to her? Defend that. We can just sit here and wait. Princess Peach is kind of broken, so we don't even take damage from these things. 
She uses her legs as like, I don't know, some kind of support. So we gotta, we gotta jump on her. Oh, we gotta knock her down off the ceiling, I guess. Like that. And then we gotta jump on her. Okay, we gotta jump on her when she comes back. Yeah, there we go, like that. Throw things at her. Yeah, come back here, where are you going? Where are you going? Are you done yet? Are you done? No, why are you, what, what are you doing? What is this? I don't even know what this is, just like throwing random things at me. Okay, it's ignored me. Let's see how I feel about that. Come on, stop wasting time. We're here to finish you off here, Mimi. Seriously, I mean, what are, we, what are we supposed to do? What is this flying spider thing going on here? No. I'm off the ceiling. Like that. You good? Come over there. Are you done yet? I've done so much damage. I guess, and like I said, I guess the damage doesn't matter. It's just about her number of legs. Oh. I guess that defends everything. <laughs> Oh, and more of this! Sorry about this long fight, guys. I'm just not... I didn't realize you had to jump on her. That was close. To uh, make it work, but, you know, whatever. We'll, we'll be finishing her off soon. No problems, right? No problems here. Mimi's pretty creepy, though. I really don't like this broken neck spider thing. It's just not working for me, you know what I mean? I'm not really a fan of spiders as it is, and broken neck Mimi spiders are just not... Not my style. No, 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 don't, don't. No, no, I'm not gonna let you hurt me enough. Oh my gosh. Oh, I wasn't even able to get an attack off there. That sucks. No, that didn't work. All right, come back over here. Oh, and it is invincible. That's not fair. How does it get to be invincible? Well, I've lost a lot of health in this fight. I think I'd like actually be good at this game by now after playing it so many times. You know, or not playing it so many times, I mean playing it so long. I've never played this game before. <laughs> Obviously showing my skills off right now. No, would you stop that? Okay, I'm just waiting for you to come back here. No, what is this? What is this bull crap? Oh my gosh, I can't, like, time this right. Ah, it's so frustrating. Look, that, I can shoot that through there. I can get her off the ceiling, and then she comes down, and you're supposed to jump on her to get rid of her legs. Her legs. Gotta get rid of them. So I gotta, I gotta focus right here, right now. We're knocking her off the ceiling. We're gonna do a good job. Maybe I could jump on her then. I don't know. Okay, get, this, get the item. Dodge. Throw and hit her. No. Dodge. Okay, jump, jump, on the first, jump on the first spike. That's not what we want. Okay. No! Stop it! The, the stupid thing pushes me to the side and then I get hit! Ah, oh, it's so frustrating! So frustrating! Oh my gosh! This part's easy as I'll get out. Next part's easy and then I just can't seem to get the jumping thing right. Can I jump? There you go. Can I jump on her again? Is your leg gone yet? Why is your legs not gone? Why are your legs not gone? Okay, dodge. What, what is it doing? What is it? Why is it taunting me? Why is it taunting me? How's this game? Why does the game keep taunting me? I just want to beat Mimi. It's been like 10 hours. Stop spinning around with your face and your skull. All right, go down. Is that done yet? Are you done? Your legs out? Yes, finally, I figured out Koops is not, oh, he, Koops is pretty dumb, all right. I don't get it. I, I got beat by a princess. Wow. That is the grossest thing I've ever seen laying there. Oh, you! Oh, what's the matter, little girl? Did I spank Mimi a little too hard? Wow, that's kind of... I guess it's a good end to a cat-on-cat -cat fight when they're spanking each other too hard, I guess. I don't know. Whatever, let's just move on. All right. You... You did it, Princess, said Luigi. Yeah, it wasn't Tippy. That was Luigi. Tippy has a little rainbow around. There we go, that's Tippy. The destruction is spreading. If we dwaddle any longer, we're doomed. Yeah, Koops, if we dwaddle any longer, we're doomed. Finish your episodes on time, Koops. Move faster. All right, Princess Peach, let's, yeah, let's go. Let's... Oh, you want to taunt your enemy some more? I approve, way to go. Mimi, you can't stay here. Go find somewhere safe. Oh yeah, that's good advice, Princess Peach, even though all worlds are ending. So no worlds are safe. 
Therefore, staying here is the safest place because everything's equally dangerous. Yeah, good advice. Good advice. Yeah. Right, like you care. Like you even care. It's true. Why would she care? Ah, I guess. Oh, what? Do they get crushed by the ceiling too in that floor? What was that loud noise? Prin princess? Oh, no, it won't open! Why does- Mario, like, doesn't even care. Like, you'd think he'd, like, run over to go and check on the door, because that's, like, his girlfriend, Princess Peach kind of thing. But no, he just, like, chills out over there. He's like, yeah, Luigi, go check and see if my, you know, my jerk of a girlfriend's over there. Like, see if she's okay. But no, nah, he doesn't even care. He doesn't even care. Oh, no! What's- <laughs> You silly princess, what are you doing? Oh, Princess Peach saved Mimi. Don't know why, but- What- What am I doing? I just slept into action without even thinking. More, the bigger question is, where did this giant hole come from? I don't want your stupid help. Just, just leave me alone. Yeah, seriously. No, I can't do that. You have been a, you have been very, very bad, but I can't leave you here to die. Sounds like a mom speaking to her child. You have been very, very bad? You mean evil? She's completely evil. She breaks her neck and turns into a spider. That's freaking creepy as hell. That's more than very, very bad. I don't know how you were raised, but I was taught to help people in need. I was also taught to not help spider neck broken things. Ah, they're weird. Peach. Wait, I've got you. Well, oh, just kidding. Wow, what a fail. Don't worry, I've got you. You're safe. Dropped like a rock. That's, that's good rescue mission there. The whole castle shook and now that door won't open? Yeah. First Bowser and now the princess. What, what do we do, bro? Hmm. We get new girlfriends, yeah! Good idea, Mario. No, we keep on going. Uh, no, but we can't leave the princess. Oh, Luigi, watch us, we're going to. Luigi cares a lot more about Princess Peach than Mario does, I've noticed. I know it's horrible, but this is, well, the end of the world, of all worlds, really, so. Princess Peach's comment about getting to somewhere safe is once again rendered useless. We must press on. Princess Peach would want it this way if she were here. Fortunately, she's dead, so she's not, so let's just kind of ignore her. Well, yeah, I guess that is a princess thing to say. I guess so. I don't know. Seems kind of weird to me that I, they're just going to leave her. They didn't even try, but I'm worried about Peach, but she'd probably be mad at us for wasting time. Okay, bro, let's go. Mario just, yeah, yeah, let's go. Get a new girlfriend somewhere else, not a big deal. And that is the end of the chapter, guys. Goodness good, because it's been a long episode. Thanks so much for tuning in. Woo! If only Koops was better at fighting bosses, maybe we wouldn't have such a problem. But anyways, guys, the next episode, we'll be continuing on to 8-3. Thanks so much for tuning in, and I'll see you guys in the next episode. Take it easy. Peace.